Instagram will catch out Dendi. Uh -oh. Where's that fissure? He's Is this gonna a need it. Go back in position. Oh, what Gets a fissure. The power of the Earthshaker. He gets around it, though. Venture's there with a stun. They're gonna charge in, but Dendi's still in trouble. It's a DDZ. DD takes out Dendi. First blood, TA. Mosin is a bit better. Could have got the full block off. Now Maybe he can wrap it around. Go Black's going to be in trouble now. The double damage rune still has plenty of time on it. Fissure comes out, charge again, but Phobos not going to get here in time. Magic missiles there. DDZ picks up the first two kills in the game. Phobos, you need to be careful here, buddy. Vengeful Spirit dies to the Shadow Fiend in the mid lane. Now Comes DDZ could get punished. The Vost is rotated over. Channels oh, up. Nice the, dodge. Oh, he misses it's it. It's not going to be enough, though. Really nice pounce dodge, but unfortunately for him, it meant that he had to travel past a few more heroes than he'd like to. I just, against the Spirit Breaker, some of the safest places to farm is your own jungle. Sniper at top lane. Gets a kill on the Spirit Breaker. Beak of the Devil. The tri lane Redemption. finally finds a kill. Took him some time. I think will yield a kill. Dendi misses the first raise, but Phobos, he can basically solo this at this point. Ice Blast comes in, but the Ancient Apparition does go down. Lance is there, has Shrapnel assassinate, but Dendi with a haste rune is not really an easy target to get. They're teeping in and picking things out here, but he gave Phobos, actually gets swapped in. He wanted to go back and fight. Assassinate, not going to do enough damage. They lose the Venge, but it looks like Phobos may be the casualty. Charge, looking to help him escape. Well, that Grave is just going to delay the inevitable, it looks like. Lance, one more right click, gets him. All right, so they end up getting the one-for-one one they were looking for. Venge plays the sacrificial lane. is the one here who can just kind of meld and hide a bit with the dust. He even kills the TA, so... Black can solo kill four of these five heroes, and that's where Redemption are just constantly grouped up and losing the farm battle. Spirit Breaker, he breaks the smoke, well, he charges Lance. He may suicide for it, but... That's... I mean, a very yeah. small kill to be getting. Unless they can turn this into Towers or Roshan, which they may do so, even if you get he's worried about that Ice Blast. Bobos charging towards the mid, the headshot's coming in, there's a swap from Moe's and he can be punished from this, Ice Blast connects, it's a shatter. Lance okay. gets another one on the scoreboard, 6-4. to four. The magic missile, and well, of all, find Jeng's eye. That Easy is kill. a... <laughs> free Dragon here. Okay, this is sneaky, I like this. DDZ can solo, uh, solo Roche, but... Not with a weave. Now he'll get charged. Blinks up to the high ground. Phobos, he thinks twice. Backs out. Zhang Zai comes in. He gets stunned up, though. There's your Ravage. Connects on one. Dendi on the high ground. Hobos doing a lot of damage. He brings down the Venge. The Spirits do a lot from Dendi. Zhang Zai, he's going to go down next. It looks like Dendi taking a lot of damage from DDZ. He'll get graved up. He's on the run. It's a one for That's two right now. Me. He's going to shatter. Oh, down he goes. Redemption winning this fight. They may catch out Yol as well. Lance got an ulti. There's no shallow grave. That's a third dead. You can't go blinking it. Dendi blinked in aggressively because he had a BKB, but TA and Sniper, they can punish that every single time. Sniper with headshot, TA with right click damage. All right. Woo. Well, one of us got game. I'm reconnecting back in. Let's go. Okay, so what do we miss? Spirit Breaker found a kill on the Venge. DDZ, oh, oh, he's going to go down. Whoa, that's a big one getting. DDZ does have buyback. They lose four, though. Charge uh -oh. looking for the fifth. It's going to be a team wipe. No ultimate. Lance in the BKB form gonna look to turn and fight. Havos. Buyback though on the TA. DDZ wants to punish this hyper aggression. Phobos gets grave. Go oh, like no. blocks him out of the face. This could be a dieback for DDZ. He's down. He's dead for 100 seconds. Navi in great shape all of a sudden. Well, that ice blast will catch Havos, but he's still got plenty of HP and just has to wait out the duration. He'll heal back up, so this may be the time when Navi seriously consider going high ground, but out. He wants to get to that secret shop, it looks like. Oh no, he's actually going... Uh -oh. Where is he going? He gets charged, he's gonna be in some trouble. Phobos stunts it up, there's the dunk, it's a dead TA. That was I'm ambitious. Crazy. Pressure, two lanes at once. Dendi in the mid, and Havost in the bottom. And Redemption, they can only ice blast one lane at a time, but oh, oh, go black, he's oh, gonna be in some trouble here. He's gonna shatter almost for sure. I, I think he's, he's okay, that Yule's blocked the ice blast damage. Ravage comes out, connects on Havos and DK Phobos. Phobos channels up the ultimate, goes on to land. Havos finds MTR. It's a dead ancient apparition. Phobos, he's gonna survive for now. Refresher, still available for Havos. Havos just zoning everyone out. Dendi using the official blade of the TA to help him out. That thing almost kills up your Spirit Breaker, but not quite enough damage. They breach a tier 3 tower, but I don't even know if they can get the Rax here. Havos, gotta be a little bit careful. Bill has the Refresher though. There's no your first Shadow blast. Dance. Down, AA's dead, and Probably figuring if he had a buyback, he would have used it by now. Yeah. AA being dead is pretty important at this stage of the game. That's the hero which can counter Havos. 
Here we, we go, go. Blink initiation on the Lance. Swap out from Mosin. He may go down from Avos. Then down comes Dendi. They'll bring him down. Now comes Phobos. Charging the back lane. He's just trying to zone him out. Make some space for the barracks. They're exposed and they're taking a lot of damage. Melee, they'll go down first. Or will they? One more auto attack. They're not going to get it. That'll be the end of the ages. I feel like they wouldn't want to go back in here. Havos has BKB and Shadow Dance. He can just go high ground with his Shadow Dance and get this melee rack. No glyph. Should be an easy rack. Yeah, there it Maybe is. even more. Havos going to go forward. Fai Zheng Zai. And down goes your Tide. Easy pick. It. Lance in trouble. Gets away with a nice full stop from your AA. But it's not going to save him. It's he goes down enough. anyways. Buybacks come in. But it's 5v2. Na'Vi. Took him a while. But they've finally broken through Redemption. All the buybacks coming out from Redemption. It's a 5v2 on the field. Venge responding soon. The tier 3 tower mid's already gone down. It'll be at least two lanes of barracks. Redemption, they need to hold here, but Avos goes in on the Lance. He's in a lot of trouble. He gets bashed and he goes down. That's the GG, 26 to 14, 52 minutes. Navi take the first game of this best of three series. Well, Team Redemption, they push Navi pretty deep into this game. They were behind for most of it getting up to like a 50k gold lead by the end, but they held on for a while. Na'Vi, just a bit more experience. Yeah. Like you said, it took him a while, but Na'Vi played with a lot of control there, respecting that